Hello everybody, welcome to examsavvy.com. Examsavvy is a site that has all the information related to examination, scholarships, fellowships, educational loans and so on. So if you are an academic or an intellectual, maybe you will have to visit the site often. This video is about to explain to you everything about NIT Junior Research Fellowship. So what exactly is NIT Junior Research Fellowship? The NIT is offering scholarships for the Junior Research Fellowship to pursue research in the career they have opted during their education levels. The NIT scholarships are invited from the interested and motivated candidates in some of the best research projects. The positions may be initially temporary but can get extended depending upon the project and the performance on the of the candidates. The projects developed during the time of the research may be, may lead to the research areas in times to the to reach the PhD positions. The junior research fellowships assist the candidates to perform well. What is NIT Junior Research Fellowships? The NIT is offering the scholarships for the junior research fellowship to pursue research in the career they have opted during their education levels. The NIT scholarships are invited from the interested and motivated candidates in some of the best research projects. The, pr the positions may be initially temporary but can get extended depending upon the project and the performance on the, of the candidates. The projects developed during the time of the research may lead to the research areas in times of reach uh, to the PhD levels. So let's take a look at these scholarship details. The research positions are available for the following projects. Project 1. Development of real-time simulation and precise modeling system using advanced geospatial and soft computing skills and methodologies. Development of real-time simulation and precise modeling system using advanced geospatial and soft computing skills and methodologies. Project 2. Fly ash to control fly ash to control acid alkali induced volume changes in soils under the Young Scientist program. Fly ash to control acid alkali induced volume changes in soils under the Young Scientific Scientist program. Moving on to the eligibility criteria, the candidate should be a first class B Tech B or B in civil engineering or agricultural engineering. The candidate should be a M.Tech in remote sensing or GIS or equivalent degree or water resources, engineering or any of its equivalent. The project mentioned above should involve the candidates with an M.Tech in geotechnical engineering. Eligibility criteria. The candidate should be a first class B tech or a BE in civil engineering or agricultural engineering. The candidate should be a M tech in remote sensing, GIS equivalent degree or water resource engineering or any of its equivalent. The project mentioned above should involve the candidates with an M tech in geotechnical engineering. So, how to apply for the scholarship? The, the application process requires the interested candidates to send out their application on a plain paper with the application number and the complete biodata details on a plain paper with fa father's name, present and permanent address. The entire contact details such as telephone number, uh, email address, detail of educational qualification with the semester wise percentage details should be neatly specified. Any kind of travel allowance TA or DA will not be allowed for the candidate to attend the interview. The hard copy or the soft copy of the application should reach before 5th April 2014. So how to apply for this fellowship? The application process requires the interested candidates to send out their application on a plain paper with the application number and the complete biodata details on a plain paper with father's name present and at permanent address. The entire contact details such as telephone number, email address, details of educational qualification with the semester wise percentage details should also be neatly specified. Any kind of travel allowance or TA or DA will not be allowed for the candidate to attend the interview. The hard copy or the soft copy of the application should should reach before 5th, 5th April 2014. Stipend and tenure. The scholarship fee amount to be paid for the scholarship is known to be 18,000 rupees for the scholarship. The duration of the candidate to be present in the fellowship is 
around three years. The fellowship is required to be known for around three to four years. The scholarship fee amount to be paid is around rupees eighteen thousand. The duration of the candidates to be present in the fellowship is around three years. The fellowship is required to be known for around three to four years. Important dates to remember: the last date of the application form is known to be fifth April two thousand fourteen. The scholarship details should should be sent to their respective National Institute of Technology. The date of the interview and the intimation of the address details are uh, to the eligible candidate will be sent through the mail only. No other important info, no other intimation is possible. Important dates to remember: the last date of the application form is known to be fifth April two thousand fourteen. The scholarship details should be sent to the respective National Institute of Technology. The date of the interview and the intimation of the address details. Uh, to the eligible candidate will be sent them sent to them via mail no other information is possible the application process involves the following address dr venkata reddy kesara principal investigator assistant professor department of civil engineering national institute of technology warangal ap 506004 email kv reddy 229 at gmail dot com. Dr. Venkata Reddy Kesara, Principal Investigator, Assistant Professor, Department of Civil Engineering, National Institute of Technology, Warangal, AP 506004. Email kv reddy 229 at gmail dot com. I believe you have learnt a lot about NIT Junior Research Fellowship. Thank you for watching. More information at examsavvy dot com. Have a great day ahead.